Instead of Bridezilla, like I'm King Cezilla. Angelo beat Jesus because he had better hair than him. This is not what I wanted. I literally cried in the store. We're delighted to announce the diamond of the season. Isabella Gonzalez cordially invites you to attend her Sweet 16. Yay, how exciting! <laughs> my name is Isabella and this is my Kingset Diary. I remember I was seven years old and her name was Giselle and she was on my Dream King Singera. Watching her, my Roman Empire, like I was just like, okay, I want to be that girl. I want to have my own quince. I want to share this experience with my family members because I'm the first in my whole family to have a quince. I think we started with um, Enchanted Forest. Too many people have that theme. I, I want to be like the trendsetter. I mean, I've seen like Bridgerton parties, but I've never seen like a Bridgerton quince. Yeah. Every single year, I had a new theme that I wanted. It, was, it went between Teal to Beauty and the Beast. Finally, I chose Bridgerton because it's a very unique theme. That theme, like that, that's how I present myself to be. Royalty, I have royalty and loyalty. I'm, <laughs> I'm smart, I'm kind, like Daphne. <laughs> I would say my extracurricular is cheer, but I would also like to incorporate like science. I really, really like science. I really like learning about the body. I like to learn about that stuff, so one day I could help my family members when they're sick. Helping other people, that makes me feel complete. It brings more happiness to me. I think it's because like I'm always on her. Like I'm always like, Mom, did you do this? Mom, are you, um, did we talk to the photographer? Mom, did we talk to the planner? Instead of Bridezilla, like I'm King Cezilla. King Cezilla, I cringe. <laughs> <laughs> if I don't bug her, the job ain't gonna get done. And we get in a lot of fights over that. It's everybody's first time being a parent, everybody's first time being a kid, and I feel like this was our first time being having a King Cez. Every single day, Every hour, actually, I would remind her, like, hey, um, did you message the event planner? And I feel I would feel bad sometimes because I knew, like, I would, like, annoy her a lot. But the job had to be done. Yeah, I'm exciting for everything, mija. Everything is exciting for me. All those women at that table, like, they just, like, mean so much to me. My grandma is... She's everything and more like I could ask for. And the other day she told me, she said, Isabella, like I knew it was you. Like I knew like you were gonna be the one. So, sorry to all my cousins out there, but. Yeah, I just remember you were little and you were like six or seven and you're like, I wanna be a princess. And we just started laughing. We're like, what do you mean you're gonna be, gonna be a princess? Where are you gonna work at? And you're like, uh, duh, Disneyland. <laughs> <laughs> Last year at school, I, I didn't have the best school year. I didn't have good stability. Even on my bad days, I knew that I could call my Nina. She would be there for me. She would give me advice. You know, she would drop everything just to come to my house and, and to make sure that I was okay. She's beautiful, she's smart, she has people around her, her family's in, like she will always be, Layla, how's your day? Layla, what's going on? How are you? She knows, like she she's the person who's like, even if you don't want to tell her how you feel, she'll know. And I love her because I'll you know, break it out of her. Always stand <laughs> up for you and she's so forgiving. So I'm not gonna cry on here. <laughs> <laughs> I just you love her. <laughs> I just love her so much. Like she understands like me more than anybody. So <laughs> she deserves. It. Sorry. When I didn't, I wasn't having the best school year. She just taught me to not let people get into my head, and she also taught me to just to say stuff back to other people. It's hard to say no to your kid. Like you want to be able to to provide and give them everything they ask for. So. I know we fight a lot about it, Bella, but I'm really, truly, truly excited for your party. I know you are. I know you're already down. My mom had two jobs in order to pay 
for my kinse. She's done so much for me and my family, and God blessed me with not only a mother, but a best friend. Go squat! One, two, three. <laughs> I gotta experience what a quinceañera experience. Hey, okay, okay. Or else it's gonna pop open. You put one, two, three. <laughs> You're not gonna look like that, I promise you, okay? Try harder, guys. Alright, All right. let's go. My first day of practice for the AC Boys, I was kind of nervous because I didn't know these people. Hello, Miss Isabella! How are you? I'm good, thank nice you. Good How are you? I'm doing awesome. These are your boys. Introduce yourself. I'm John. I'm Angel. I'm George. I'm Angelo. I'm Jesus. Okay. I want you to tell them about your theme. The theme of my party is Bridgerton. Do y'all know what that is? That's a huge word. <laughs> so Bridgerton is I usually explain it as very like Victorian, like Mary Antoinette. Like they have a lot of money and they go to fancy balls. They have this thing called the diamond of the season. And the diamond of the season is usually the girl who's the most prettiest, the nicest. The queen pick, the queen picks the diamond of the season. We're gonna do something we've never done before. We're gonna let you choose your main chamberlain. Okay. We've never done this before, ever, ever. So go for it. <laughs> I need your opinion, I need your opinion. Okay. Come, come with me, come with me, okay. And I did not want to go into that studio by myself, so luckily like my best friend, she came with me, and that calmed down my nerve. So we know. This way! Oh, that middle oh. one is like OG. Yeah, we don't want to go OG. Mmm. Why? <laughs> <laughs> No, the, the two, two, two. Yes. Okay, on the side. Okay, okay. It was between um, Jesus and um, Angelo. One, two, three. We pick Angelo. There he is. <laughs> perfect, because I was gonna pick him for you already. Yeah, perfect. It was meant to be. All right, let's go from the top. Angelo in the middle with Isabella. Layla was like, oh, like he has a good haircut, like he has to fade, like that, that'll look good, like that, that'll look good, like contrast, you know? So I was like, you know, I'm gonna trust you, I'm gonna trust my best friend, so. You're there. I feel special. You feel special? It's not gonna last long, don't worry. Angelo beat Jesus because he had better hair than him. Oh, it sounds very elegant. It's super strange, like. Yeah. So definitely it's gonna be a challenge for all of us because we've never done a full instrumental one. So thank you for that. But we got it, yeah? They don't, they don't sing at all? Huh? They don't sing like at all? No, they don't sing Period. at all. I really like that song because it just talks about how people change. And that's what the song is called. It's called Changes. So you're gonna hold one, two, three, four. You're gonna go rainbow and you're gonna go curtsy. Hi, Lorena, I already love you. I already love this. Ready? <laughs> and I chose the instrumental because the song with the words is actually really, really sad. Five, six, seven, eight. You go one and two spin towards the back wall. Spin, two, three, four. There you go. Do you feel like his arm's pushing you that way? No, I just no? went the wrong Throw her. Throw her. <laughs> Throw her. Ready? Okay. And you're going to fly. Ready? Five, six, seven, eight. One and two. Turn. Da, da, da. Well, she's gonna give you an extra spin. Okay. One spin. So one spin, you're here. Okay. Uh, are you ready? a dancer? No. What are you? I'm a cheerleader. Oh, you're a cheerleader? Yeah. Can you tell? Yeah. How? I mean, I thought she was a dancer. Why? I don't know, because dance is good. Yeah, I'm teaching her. I'm teaching her a good one. I liked it because I liked the melody and how it flowed. I relate with it because a lot of my friends and a lot of people that I thought I knew, they changed. One, two, out, spin, rainbow, five, six, seven, eight. Nice, all right, from the top. And then I'll add you guys and then I'll give you guys a little break to talk. I feel like I'm in a movie. I don't know why. I always feel like I'm in a movie. I like to think of life. I'm the main character in my life. Like this is my story my life. I like to live up to that expectation. See leader. So what position do you have? Just positions, right? Uh, yeah, I'm a base, so I like lift them and like throw them. What's your football position? I play running back and linebacker. Oh, okay. Yeah. You know what that is, huh? 
you guys came you came in all confident i'm like oh no they know each other already i thought you were a dancer because i saw you looking at them I'm like is she dancing that no uh, so you never dance like competition no but i've, I've been doing cheer since i was like six or seven oh, damn, that's so like kind of know like how to learn things fast how to like dance fast oh, okay. I'm not just anyone else. I know my stuff, I know what I'm doing, I, I know what I want, how I want it. So it honestly made me, like, it boosted my ego a little. Bit. You're gonna go right leg, and then right leg's gonna cross, and you're gonna switch sides with them. So you're only using the right leg. Ready, try slowly, go. Triple, and pivot right leg, switch sides. Boom, yeah, yeah. Hey, yeah, yeah, yeah. just go. Go, walk, 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 yeah, yeah. walk. Take a step, and then flip. Yeah. <laughs> like that? Yeah, but it's, it's all more smaller. So triple and then just step and switch. Oh, switch. You were like, no. I like put my leg over. Yeah. Five, six, seven, eight. Triple and pivot and triple and pivot. Yeah. So that so pivot it's like is really quick. It's a small step. Step. Okay. Try it again. Ready? Five, six, seven, go. One and two. There you go. There you go. Three Woo! and four. There you go. That was it. Okay. Yeah, did you see that? That's good. Yeah. It was I know what I'm doing. I know what I'm doing. That was giving Alfredo techniques. I know what I'm doing. Ready? I had fun every single practice in Alfredo. Like, he was a huge aspect of the fun. I really liked his ideas how he articulated things. I like how his words on his wall that says if you want to, like you would. That made me feel like more happy because that's like my story here. Best friend? Yeah. I saw it, I saw it. Yeah? That was good, that was do, good. Do we approve? We all approve? So far, yes. Yeah. Good, excited. Good excited. Ready to see Isabella's dress. It looks itchy, but it's not itchy. <laughs> when I first saw the dress, I saw another girl trying the dress on. The lighting in the store just made the dress look so beautiful. The way it sparkled, it made me feel like, that's my dress. That is the dress that I'm gonna have. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> that's my favorite part. I think I'm gonna do that all night. I'm just... <laughs> I liked my dress, I was happy with it, but I just felt like I wish it could would have been better. When we got it, it was like a totally different color from what we tried on. It looked like I had lonjas. It made my like boobs look chueco. I literally cried in the store in front of the workers. Like I was like, this is not my dress. This is not what I wanted. This is not what I pictured. Mom was like, meh. And Tia Rossi was like, mm -mm. The reason why I picked the dress was because the color, it matched my skin tone. The lime color did not match my skin tone at all. I was, it was so sad, detrimental. I, I was so like, that just broke my, my Kingsa Dreams heart. What they gave me looked nothing like this. I, I didn't have like my dream dress moment. If you would like your Kingsa featured on Kingsa Diaries, click the link below in the description.